The diplomatic relationship between Thailand and France has long been historically established mm -hmm. since in the 17th century to commemorate and enhance this relationship. Yes. Our Thai government has decided to rename one of its public streets that leading to the French embassy as, I wish you could say it in French accent, Rue de Brer, wow, a Rue de Brest <laughs> in Urbanista. Welcome to Urbanista. In here, we will provide you what's happening in Bangkok from social life to cultural corner. And for today, we're going to talk about the relationship between France and Thailand. Did you know that France and Thailand has established their relationship since the 17th century, back in time of Louis XIV and the King Narai of Ayutthaya? And to enhance this and to commemorate this strong Thai relationship between both countries, one of the name will be given given to a street of Jerengung Road that leads towards the French embassy. It's called Rue de Brest. Let's check it out. This collaboration all started from ex-French ambassador to Thailand, Gilda Lolidet, who proposed the name Rue de Brest to be one of the streets in Bangkok and to commemorate the strong Thai of Franco-Thai relationship. The street chosen was on Jaren Gung Road, Soi 36, leading its way to the French embassy in Bangkok. We are celebrating the inauguration of the Rue de Brest, Soy Brest, or Tanoms uh, Brest, uh, which is a wink of eye to the joint history between France and Siam, and Thailand. Uh, it refers to the harbour city in the west uh, of France, uh, in a province called Brittany, and with a famous harbour city called Brest, where the first uh, Siamese ambassador disembark uh, at the time of uh, King Pranarai and King Louis XIV of France. I have to uh, uh, play uh, to give uh, honor to my predecessor, uh, Ambassador Lolidec, who comes from Brittany, and uh, for this reason, ask the municipality of Bangkok if the street leading to the French embassy and the French residence could be named Rue de Brest, as there is a Rue de Siam in Brest in commemoration of the first Siamese embassy in that French city of Brest. This is the whole story about it, and we are quite uh, grateful to the city of Bangkok that uh, it has accepted to change the name and baptize it uh, Rue de Brest. And just like in France, Rue de Siam was named after the arrival of a group of diplomats from Siam. The Siamese team boarded for the first time in Brest, a city situated in Brittany province, to continue their journey 600 kilometers to Versailles to pay their official visit to the Sun King, Louis XIV. Since then, people in Brest quickly call the street Rue de Siam. And how long did you have Rue de Siam? It has been uh, right soon after the first Siamese ambassador disembarked, mm -hmm. that is to say around 700, uh, the local people who were so impressed by the beautiful garments worn uh, by the Siamese ambassador, they were quite impressed by people they have never met before coming from the Far East, and they were peasants or fishermen. And so they were so astonished that they uh, the name, the city, the street where the embassy and his court, the ambassador and his cottage walked on, they said that is the Rue de Siam as a uh, uh, recognition uh, for the Siamese uh, embassy who first uh, led the, the feet on the French soil. Mm -hmm. Apart from Rue de Brest in Bangkok, Thailand already has Rue de Paris in Lopuri province as well. And as for the Rung Road, it was once one of the main economic zones in Bangkok, built during the time of King Rama IV. Jaran Krum Road was the very first street to be built in Bangkok due to its location. The area was the place for many foreign consulars and trading establishments. And if you 
pass by around Jaren Gurung Road, don't forget to check Khu de Brest out and be the first one to take a pic with it. Upload it on Instagram, show it off to your friends, and maybe you can fool them that you were actually in France. And that's all the time we have for today. I'll see you again next week in Urbanista on Good Morning ASEAN. Sadika. That wraps up today's edition of Good Morning ASEAN. See you again, same time, same place, same channel. You can catch us again 7:30 to 8 a.m. on Gung Khe Turkey TV and we now to proceed. And I'm Patsura Desha Putarang Si Sadika. Sadika. Thank you.